It's Ron Goodall from FightHype.com. I'm here with Roy Nelson. How's it going? Good. Uh, we got a big fight, main event coming up this Friday. Uh, a rematch. How you feeling? Feel, feel good. I mean, it's a rematch. You know. Uh, you know, obviously going into this uh, fight, how was training camp? How was everything? And, uh, training camps, training camps. You got your bumps and your bruises, you know, and you just, you know, hopefully you can just come out on the other end uh, on the good side. Now, do you still like uh, have a relationship with Roger Mayweather, and, and do you kind of work with some? I still here? still go over to Mayweather, still go over Bones Adams, uh, the Prince uh, Prince Ranch uh, gym, uh, then over Extreme. Like I mean, I mean, I'm in Vegas. I go I go wherever I can find uh, work. Now you know when, when you're in that environment, you know with the Mayweathers and all that. How is it? It's just fun, but uh, you know the I, Mayweather's gym is you know it's it's good as long as you know it's all about respecting. So as long as a lot of people respect you, you're you're always gonna be okay. Now um, going into the rematch, do, do you expect um, to have like a, a different game plan? You know going into this fight approach when you first. Yeah, I, th I think uh, the fight's definitely gonna be different because it's definitely. Uh, we're two different fighters uh, now. I mean, that was like 10 years ago or something like that. So definitely a different, uh, I think it's a different uh, fight. Now, now coming off his, his previous uh, his losses, they've been all, you know, been a, a knockout loss streak for most of them. Do you, do you feel like going into this fight that you'll be able to uh, stop him as well going into this fight? Um, for me, I... I don't. I'm not sure. I mean, because I, you know, people think I suck, so I, I have no idea. Uh, the only thing I know is Frank's. You know, depends on if he's on the juice or not, because he, you know, it's been a long time since he's won, just because he did have that uh, that little break there. So uh, I don't know. I don't know if uh, the juice, you know, weaks you in the brain. I don't know. <laughs> now. Um, seeing that you're also a big boxing fan as well, and if you find a chance, I can get some predictions of upcoming fights of uh, the heavyweight division of Joshua Ruiz uh, rematch. Do you uh, Joshua Ruiz, that one's I, I'm definitely gonna watch because it's uh, definitely because you thought uh, Joshua was gonna walk through uh, Ruiz last time and then uh, Ruiz knocked him out. So the the one thing about the heavyweight division, anybody can win because all you gotta do is land that one shot. And then seeing that Deontay Wilder has a fight coming up with uh, Luis Ortiz a rematch. I did. I actually didn't see that one. Um, oh, okay. So that one, I, I'm gonna have to go back and watch the first one. Now, now I know you're a big, you know, fight fan as well. And coming up is you know the Canelo versus Sergey Kovalev fight. Uh, do you have any opinions on that? You know that he's going up in wing. That one. Is, with the with the weight coming up and weight, because uh, boxing is different. I mean, it all depends on what his natural weight is. I don't know what his natural weight is. So is it really going up, or is he just at his like fight weight? Because like Mayweather doesn't really like he didn't really drop weight. He like dropped like three pounds, and that's like or he'd be like, oh, I'm way under. I gotta eat. So I think usually wherever you fight at uh, and don't cut weight, I think you usually do the best that you possibly can. And then um, on that same day, there's uh, like the BMF belt that's being put out between you know the Nate Diaz and. Oh, uh, you know I'm, I'm definitely gonna watch uh, Nate, um, but that's all I care about is uh, Nate Nate's fight. So I got Nate winning just because I got Nate. You know, and, and did you see his last performance? And then going into a fight with Jorge, you know, you mentioned that there's like a different. Uh, you know, pace that you, you wanted to go with. Yeah, no, I think any time uh, um, like Nate gets five rounds, it's definitely uh, he, he's a he's a workhorse. I mean, he just works and works and works and works and works. Uh, so, I mean, nothing against basketball. It's just I just like Nate, so I'm just gonna go with my boy. You, you know, just a bit because. The way that you beat Nate, like with uh, I've seen Nate get beat is just by uh, wrestlers. Okay. Now you know, um, you know, any it's not strikes. <laughs> Good striker, just like yourself. And you know, and just um, ending out, uh, ending this interview. Is there anything that you want to tell your fans leading up and what to expect coming up on uh, Friday? I just, you know, make sure you watch on Friday um, and go to RoyNelson.com and also Rico Products. Uh, actually, it's Rico's.com is. Uh, <laughs> And get some nacho cheese to watch the fight. <laughs> awesome. I appreciate it. Thank Thanks. you so much.